Grace and peace be unto you from God our Father and Yeshua our Lord and Savior and King to come. How great once again to be with you and with all my heart and with the knowledge that you people are such true friends, such true blessing to this boy life. And we have uh, taken a uh, season out with all this teaching and preaching, asking you to remember to really help me. It's such a great thing to really be able to preach together and with your ideas and your verses and your insight to go deeper into the Word of God, into the messages which I really want to pass on to the congregation Secret Assembly. Well, for this upcoming week, this is next Friday evening, I have this thought and I would really appreciate your input because some of you really take time, meditate, and come up with some great verses helping me to just go deeper in bringing forth truth into the hearts of people, imparting blessing into the hearts of people uh, to walk that narrow walk, that holy path which is so close to my heart. If we walk, let us walk. Yes, let us walk the walk that he's talking about. Let us live the life that he's talking about. Let us not dance on the fence. And I want to thank you for those of you who really take it sincerely, seriously, and dig in scriptures and come up with some verses and some insight of how to go on with this foundation I want to give you. So the idea the Lord put on my heart, single-mindedness. We're going to talk about single-mindedness. And then from obedience to blessing, from obedience to blessing. Beginning with Haggai, in Hebrew, Haggai. <laughs> That's in Hebrew, you call him Haggai, but his name is Haggai, yeah? Chapter 2, verse 19. Min hayom ze avarech. From this day I will bless you, say Haggai, yes? And then from Exodus. אנוכי אדוני אלוהיך אשר הוציאתי לך מארץ מצרים מבית עבדים לא יהיה לך אלוהים אחרים על פניי אל תעשה לך פסל וכל תמונה אשר בשמיים ממעל ואשר בארץ מתחת ואשר במים מתחת לארץ. English? Yes, English. I am the Lord your God who brought you out of the land of Egypt out of the house of slavery you shall have no other gods before me. And Closing up with Matthew 6, 33. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness and all these things will be added to you. This is uh, in a nutshell where we want to go this upcoming next Friday and our service in our congregation. Any input, any insight, it will be so welcome. As for those of you who pray for this uh, boy health, I want to encourage you. I'm getting better and better, and I want to thank you with all my heart for your prayer, love, and uh, true friendship. Keep strong, very courageous in the love, in the grace, in the might of the Lord. And as always, a holy kiss right from here, Tel Aviv, Israel. And I long for the days when I can start traveling again and perhaps visit you and home. Keep in touch. Keep in touch. Shalom, shalom.